percentage profit and loss. I forgot half the title. When you are running a business, you're always, of course, wanting to make a profit. That means you are bringing in more money than you spent when all your expenses and income is taken into account. Mostly we'll just look at profit and loss on individual transactions. So I buy something for this much, I sell it for that much, did I make a profit or a loss, and what percentage profit or loss did I make? So profit happens when what you sell it for, the selling price, is more than the cost price, what you paid for it. More. So the selling price is more than the cost price. That means you got more than you paid for it. And to calculate profit, this is just the amount of profit. So profit is just selling price minus cost price. And you would have to say then that this was the amount of profit you were finding. So very much in your working, you would say the profit was the selling price minus the cost price. A loss happens when the cost price is more than the selling price. So if it cost you something like $100 to buy something and then you sold it for $80, you've made a $20 loss. And you calculate loss, it's not very um, surprising, by doing the cost price minus the selling price. And the formula for percentage profit is the amount of profit over the cost price times 100. So it's what percentage of the pro cost price did you get extra in profit? And percentage loss is your loss amount over the cost price times 100. What percentage of the original price did you lose? So for example, during a sale, single beds are sold for $599 and the bed cost the store $570. And I've said calculate the percentage loss, but there's a problem there because our selling price is more than our cost price. So of course we are calculating percentage profit. Sorry. Sometimes the question will say profit or loss and you have to decide which one you've got. So your steps are, first up, you calculate the amount of profit or loss and then you use the percentage formula from here. So this was profit. Profit is when the selling price is more than the cost price and it's selling price take away the cost price. So they're selling it for 599, it cost them 570. So the amount of profit was 599 minus 570, which is $29. Not very much profit. That's the amount of profit. Then the percentage profit, go up to our formula, the amount of profit over the cost price times 100. That's our formula. 
the amount of profit was 29, the original cost price was 570, times 100, 29 divided by 570 times 100, and 5.087, so the one decimal place, will have 5.1%, and because it's profit, we say we're finding profit. So they only made about 5% profit, not very impressive, but it was on sale, so at least they still made a profit.